Yo, what's up YouTube? This is a video for all my fellas out there around the world. Um, you probably already know this, this stuff I'm going to be talking about, but I'm going to tell you the top 10 things not to say to your girlfriend, your wife, um, or e even on the first date. Um, now, I'm coming out right now. I'm going to say this right now before I even start. I'm no relationship guru. I, I, I'm no whiz with the ladies. This is purely from my experience. Um, these are things that you shouldn't say to women. Okay? I, I bet the women out there will have something to say. Hey, I know, it's just it just comes with the territory. Leave comments. Leave some comments. You know, um, let, let me know what you think of these things. Um, uh, I think you'll find this useful. Enjoy. Tip number one. Should we split the bill 50-50 or should we just pay to get... Look guys, you shouldn't even ask the question. You should just always assume that you're going to pay for everything. Um, that's sort of the traditional way the guy pays for the dinner or for the coffee or whatever. Um, if you're not sure, just wait till the bill comes to the table. This is what I do. Wait for the bill to come to the table, see if you can read some signs. She might even jump in before you and say, hey look, let me give you a little bit of money. But if it's the first date, usually I would say, no, 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 don't worry, I'll take care of it. It makes you look like a gentleman, makes you look awesome, um, and the chick, the, ch the chick will dig that. If she keeps persisting, oh, let me pay half, let me pay half, just let her pay half. You're just going to cause problems. You don't want to be in an argument on your first date. That's just, yeah, that's just not good. Um, and she might find it rude if you keep rejecting, rejecting her offer. So definitely, definitely let her pay half, half. Number two. Okay, you never say this. You look like my ex. Whew. That's one definite conversation stopper. You do not want to say that. I don't really need to explain why not to. Just don't say it because it would lead. It will lead to bad things. Three. Don't say, oh, that chick at the bar, she's damn fine. You do not say to your girlfriend, wife, or even on the first date, you'd be stupid to say on the first date. You'd be stupid to say at all, actually, that that chick over there is hot. Ooh, unless you agree on, like, an open relationship agreement, mm, it's best not to go there. Four, I don't think you'd be saying this on... A first date, but maybe if you've been going out with your girlfriend or, or even a wife, still you never ever say we should go on a diet. Oh man, speak for yourself, man. Oh. If you're gonna if you're gonna say that to your wife, girlfriend, or whatever, you may as well go and jump off a bridge now because before they push you off a bridge. Number five, you look different in the morning. Damn, you need to have massive balls to be able to say that to to your girlfriend or wife. Or well, you probably never see her another day. Again, obvious reasons. <laughs> I won't. I don't recommend you to say that. Six. Well, you really look like your mum. This is really a compliment for women, and I don't know how it can be. Um, but it's a good way to start most fights um, with your partner. Um, and they probably get a bit worried that you kind of got something for their mum. Um, so that's a bit awkward. Number seven. Are you putting on weight? Let's just start with the obvious. She'll probably jump the table and strangle you to death for saying that. Um, again, try, try, and, try, try and avoid the subject altogether. But eight. Maybe we should take a break. That's sort of saying, okay, let's break up temporary or this is a nice way of me saying I don't like you get him out of life. Uh, if you're gonna if you're gonna say that she's probably just gonna dump your ass and find a find a new guy to hang out with who's gonna take the relationship more seriously. So if you actually do want a break, I would not say Maybe we should take a break because that will just confuse her even more. And I'm kind of confusing myself now what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Number nine. I love you. 
Oh, don't say it unless you mean it, okay? A, a, a lot of women take this statement very seriously if a man's going to come out and say it. Everyone knows that a man don't come out and say I love you that easily unless they mean it. So don't say it unless you mean it. Otherwise, they'll assume automatically that, that, that the relationship's going to the next level and, you know, they'll be expecting a ring and kids and in a house in a year or so. So avoid that unless you mean it. It's really nice if you say it, but you've got to mean it. Don't get someone's hopes up. It's not good. Number 10. I reckon this is the big one. I left this to last because I think it's the big one. How old are you? Whew. Okay, if the woman appears to be over 30 or, or older, I wouldn't ask her. I would ask a series of questions, you know, bang around the bush, you know, um, not asking directly what age is, you know, for, for example, like, oh, how many years have you been working for that company, or when, when did you graduate uni, or when did you graduate high school? You can sort of take an educated, educated guess on how old she is by the information she gives you. That's probably the best way um, to get around that. But if she looks like she's under 18, you absolutely must ask her her age because, man, you, you want to make sure she's a little age. You don't want to be locked up behind bars. <laughs> Look, guys, that's my top 10 what not to say to women. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it's not too boring. This is my first video and it will get better. Please rate, thumb the shit out of this video for me, favorite, spread it to your mates, Let, give them a bit of a heads up what not to say. Um, Leave some tips or, or, or some ideas in the comments if you want to, if you want me to uh, talk about any topics that you might want to know about, um, such as like for example today I'm thinking of doing a, a video of what women shouldn't say to men. Um, so look, so subscribe so you're up to date so you can catch up with that video. Thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. I hope that helps. Bye.